Hello everyone. This is Agasta and welcome to Agasta's garden. Uh today I'm planning to make a very short video on how to get rid of pests on your cactus and succulents. The most common uh, pests that I have found that attack the cactus and succulents uh, is a mealybug and uh, what I have seen here are the scale leaf bugs. This particular plant that I have treated with the method that I am going to explain to you now uh, was attacked by mealybugs. Unfortunately, since I have cleaned the plant, I am not able to show you uh, the bugs on the plant. But if you look at the plant, you can see that it's it's uh, a, a little uh, deformed with the leaves kind of curled up. Uh, so if you notice this kind of curling of leaves for your uh, succulents, do take the time to look under the leaves. and you will see that it has been attacked uh, by uh, the mealy bugs uh, which normally uh, come on to the very tender part of the succulent and and under its leaves and maybe on the stem surface the second kind of bugs which normally attack uh, the uh, cactus uh, are the scaly bugs If you look here you can see what the scaly bugs look like. Since this plant was a uh, uh, very badly attacked by uh, scaly bugs I had to actually uh, dismember almost the plant. You can see how badly uh, it has been affected here. So now to show you how we are going to treat this plant I am going to be using a uh, organic kind of a pesticide. The one that I am using here is uh, neem oil. This product where uh, which I am using, uh, I have purchased it on Amazon. The link for the purchase of this product is in the description below. I am using a direct application of the neem oil onto the plant take a little neem oil in a container uh you can use either use a q tip for a surface that is flat like this a neem bug bud works very well however if you have a plant with leaves it's a little difficult to get the q tip into uh the inside of the leaves so using a brush is something that would uh, help you to reach deep into the plant so applying a little oil on to the brush you apply it on to the mealy bug and uh take it out from the plant for this surface i will use a q tip So I'm applying a little of the uh, neem oil on the tip. Now I will rub it along the surface of the cactus which has got the scale bugs on it. You can see that the scales are actually peeling off from the surface of the plant. Can you see all the scales on the Q-tip? see these are all the scales and the surface has come clean so once again the bugs i will rub the q tip on it sometimes you may have to press it a little because the scale bugs uh, actually latch on to the surface of the uh, cactus and uh, it takes out the sap from the plant 
and uh, that is how uh, it damages the plant. So now I'm cleaning it up uh, with a cleaner surface. You can see that the scales from here have been completely wiped out. If you want, you can use a piece of cloth and rub the surface. Now this is the clean plant. No, no uh, scales on it. So this is what happens when the plant is attacked by scale bugs. You can see the plant has turned yellow and you can see fine spots of yellow on the plant. Now if the plant is badly infected then you need to cut off that part which I'm going to do towards to the plant at the end of it because it's really badly infected with the scale bugs. So now uh, once this wound has calloused then you can plant this into the soil. So this uh, part of the plant or this particular piece that I had to uh, break from the original plant is almost clean. There's just a few of the scales which I'll try and take out now. And getting rid of the bugs is as easy as this. Another one that was infected is this one. I will show you the bugs on this. This is another case of the scale bug on a succulent. So with the neem oil on the Q-tip, I will uh, apply it and uh, clean it up with the cloth. And that's it folks. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please do not forget to hit the like button. And for more content like this, please do subscribe. Until next time, happy gardening.